What's up guys, just driving home from work. I uh, was going, going to quickly touch on the events from last night. If uh, you haven't heard by now, uh, YouTube star and star from The Voice, Christina Grimmie, uh, has died. She was shot by, I'm not going to say his name, she was shot by, shot by a 27 year old male. Um, I just don't ever get the point in saying the guy's name and posting his picture everywhere. It uh, it gives too much infamy and, and well fame to these people. So not gonna mention his name. Not gonna post any pictures. Um, it's out there on the internet. I mean, if you really want to see it, but it doesn't mean anything at the end of the day. So the police report said that. Uh, the gunman brought two guns, two magazines, and a knife. Um, traveled from wherever town or city he lived in to Orlando, where uh, Christina was performing. And around 10 o'clock after the meet and greet, um, where they were signing autographs and selling merchandise, uh, the gunman opened fire, uh, shooting her three times. I think, in which case Christina's brother uh, tackled the suspect, and um, in the in the midst of, of the struggle or whatever happened, the gunman ended up shooting himself, taking his own life. So I don't understand it. Um, I never will understand the people that do these types of, types of things. Uh, so the brother, who I can't even imagine what he's going through, um, for the rest of his life, I know if it were me, uh, no matter how many, uh, he is a hero, like by all means, like it's, 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 but I don't, I don't think telling him that is, is, if it were me, and I was in that, in that same exact situation, um, I would not feel like a hero, um, even though he saved, potentially, if the, if the gunman had two guns and two magazines, he potentially saved dozens of people's lives. So he is a hero. Um, I saw a... I don't, granted, I don't know if this is real, because, I mean, it's on Reddit, but... Somebody said they're a friend of the family and that they texted him and said, you're a hero um, and some other kind words. And uh, all he sent back was, wasn't fast enough, which is really rough. Like I said, I can't even, I can't even imagine um, what he and the rest of the family are going through. But if you've, uh, if you've watched YouTube for, for, I don't know, she was like, Christina was maybe one of the first 10 or 15 people I started watching. I didn't really follow her career through The Voice, but uh, from what everybody around her said, she was a great person. Obviously, um, there's no... I don't even know. I don't, know. I don't know what to say. There's no bright side. There's no there's just nothing to this it's just some waste of life who made an extra trip to to go do this for unspecified reasons um it's there's there's nothing to explain i i don't know what to say so i'm gonna put a a link down below her um producer or manager um made a GoFundMe for the family. I'll be donating $250. Um, that's what I can afford at the moment. Um, if, if whoever, my small audience, but you guys are pretty supportive of the channel and of me. So I know I have a small audience, but you know, if, if there's anything you can donate, um, please check out that link. And if, you know, if you can't, I mean, if it's one or $2 even, I mean, anything helps at this point 
Um, even if you just just uh, a retweet um, to promote the GoFundMe, not not my video. Um, this video won't be monetized, or or I, I won't. I'm not asking for views. I'm not asking you to retweet my video. But if you if you like um, tweet out the GoFundMe, or maybe I'll make a tweet, and if you retweet that, um, if even if that's what you can do, I mean anything helps. It's just really awful situation. A lot of times when stuff like this happens, um, it provokes a lot, a lot of hate, a lot of anger, um, as it should. The the first thing um, I felt when I read that, and I'm not even close to the most emotional. Well, I'm not even close to a normal emotional person, but. It, you're just angry or irritated like just angry that like you don't understand why these things happen or you look for an explanation or a reason but there's not people are just messed up so all I can say is um, you know if, if you if you go to concerts um, if you go to meet and greets with um, whether it be YouTube or celebrities wh whatever they are uh, if you guys ever see anything suspicious, uh, anything like that, you know, just do what you can. Let somebody know as soon as you can. And and definitely don't stop going to these to, to events. You know, if people are blowing up planes or shooting people at concerts or um, attacking football stadiums, the one thing you, you never want to do is... is alter our way of life because of, of evil you just you spread what love or happiness you can and you just continue on with your life um, you never forget those you know that are going through this but you, you don't change you don't stop going to concerts um, you don't stop doing meet and greets you don't stop going to football games, whatever it is, you don't stop. Um, our way of life doesn't cease because of generally terrible people. So, you know, spread love. Um, don't spread hate. It's okay to be angry. But pretty much, like at this time, all you really start to realize is uh, life is really short. Don't spend time um, worrying about what could happen or what's happened in the past. Just don't spend time being angry. Just spend time with people who make you happy and enjoy it while you can because you'll never know when it's gone. So, uh, I'm not going to be putting up any other, other videos today. This will be the only video for today. So, um, like I said, if you guys can check out the link in the description down below for the GoFundMe. You know, if you, if you do donate, let me know. Um, just so I can thank you. And, uh, as always, guys, stay safe. And I'll uh, see you guys tomorrow.